Base clan. They are running out of meds. The blue <gasps> is tanking. They are in the oh! line of sight when it comes to STK. The hammer is coming down on FaZe Clan. One of Europe's number one teams is being punished <laughs> by North American <laughs> powerhouse. It's hungry for blood. And at the moment, Here it comes, comes down to Fuzz Face with basically no health whatsoever. Purdy Curdy, do you end this here He's and dead. now? He's dead to blue. Oh He's dead to blue. Oh my god. They've done it. That is a thought out hot drop, Toby. It's He's done. Dead to it's... Blue. Yeah, there's nothing you can do. Totally fine with this. But look at that. Even in the distance, we're looking through the scope of someone else. We can see DA running into this one, Toby. Smash! All of it. What? Woo! Smash! What have you done? Down to just one player. Smash still alive, but that's it. Can he do anything with this? Maybe Oath gets a little over aggressive, who knows? But Smash, he gets one. He sprays, he gets oh my two. God. A third? Oh, another! Smash but a insane. quick trade out! Rello. And Oath picks up the victory. Very Rom starting to realize they've got the control to play from the flanks coming around back behind it. Turtle has nowhere to go. Covers being lost at every single second. Tries to go for the big round. Does manage to get one of them down, but he's down so low. <clears throat> gets the second one. Turtle's trying to turn this around with everything he's got. Just 20 bullets left and Ops into going for the spray. This is going to be a huge problem popping off for Turtle right now. He has to be so cautious. On the other side, it's God Meow trying to find the angle for it and has the save zone. Using a little bit of his teammate for cover, trying to use the car as well. A little bit of position coming up from the other side of it. Turtle's trying to find the angle to go from. Trying to use a little bit of utility, maybe trying to get something off of this. Running back down to the car, he knows where he's at. Goes for the spray back oh! and, it and he does it! TSG and Gex. Gex does have one of their members down, trying to go for the res back over towards it. But do note, TSG's got this wide angle back on the outside of it. Looks like they're trying to look through the smokes, and oh, that's no. not going to happen. Yan Lee does manage to get the shot back over towards him. Bully Bear, now the last one up, looking back over towards this. Not a lot of utility to work with. Trying to see if he can get the spray back over towards it. Gets one, looks back over towards it, tries to get two, does manage to get three. What are you kidding me? I guess Meta's building is probably the easiest place to crash, but let's see what Sparky oh, can do. He's got the smokes up. He's already going to have a little bit of green aid. Everything's going to be coming through. Everyone's piling in on this side. They are all going to go towards us. He's got one bullage down. Oh my god, what? the nade! He just got everyone sparking! The one man army has just destroyed LG Divine. How did he just do that on his own? Is he the Terminator? Is this T100 coming back? This is meta sparking. This was the name that we said you will know by the end of this tournament do clutch moments uh no matter who it is that is left alive and that's something yep. that's really huge that you're not just relying on if that person is still alive then we can win avoid e36 to avoid detonation and multi-search everybody can see this good shot going up from leo Ooh, oh my god the uh, friends, you know, you're not. for rams not. deeper angle no, he's, he's not going to get away with that. They had so much room in Saverni to be able to get those wide angles. Shinboy, probably about to be Whoop. dead here. Actually, maybe not. Takes one with him. Sprays away. Takes, what? takes another. Oh, oh, he's still alive. Ow, Gen G just him. beat him. Harvey just trying to find something forever. We'll get Besto down, and that's going to be the green <gasps> light. What? No way. Crazy actually huh? just dumps the Senya. I'd get inside and try and give me some help here, brother. Because I'd see if he comes up these stairs. This is a vital opportunity. No, oh, no. Oh, no. What no. have you done? Considering <laughs> where to go on this. So, uh, are they going to pull up in Gatka? It Ooh. might be. I'm not sure. Hold on. P Buram are, uh, are insane. Honestly, insane. Madrada is just going to be surely getting the flush on. Oh. This... <laughs> Jesus. Jesus. Is he stuck? Oh no! Oh no! I'm... Oh! Can we forget this game ever happened? In fact, just give them the complete info of where Son Yang was, getting the res up there in first about a 3v1. I thought that one had this in the books. Getting the vehicle over on the other side of the road, get that off-angle position, even if it's a bait or not, we don't care. We're gonna make the push. Here comes the drive by oh. Anonix gets the killings. You have to put so much faith in them to find you a secure spot, not only for now, but with an exit plan to the next route forward.
that that's disgusting that's actually disgusting. passenger seat yeah, this will become a bit of a, a bit of a problem especially with two of them trying to loot about the front he's sending the vehicle what? he's in the back of it he's an absolute what man. what is he doing gen g this is insanity can you get the final one peels there as well is he in backup in the position the vertus pro hold they will potentially have vision if they crest over but tulin spyro oh welcome to vertus pro this is the Roll it back to the Northern Lights look at this point. Furnace Pro are a scary team. They're in four. Oh my god, that car. <gasps> oh! What the? Somebody get a doctor. I don't think he's okay. Little section here. Look at this. Yeah, this is a bit of a cluster. You've got Tiamba here. You've got Fury here. And DA trying to leave it. What? What? Excuse me? Is he trying to Goomba? Like. Uh... Oh no, and he still gets the kill. What? <laughs> They didn't. They live to see another day, and so far we've only lost three. Wait, wait what? Did Indigo wait, wait. just do with this vehicle? <laughs> Did it okay. just do a flip up the Abs wall? From south to north, they're gonna make the play towards Loki. They want another team gone. Open up some avenues of approach. Good tag comes in. That's a headshot. Loki gonna try and. No. <laughs> no way. You wouldn't. Dead. Cross towards kind of the other side of the road. Phase, though, heading right towards oh. shooting range. This could be dangerous. Zenith on the other side. They have got a man knocked. Not sure if they're aware of it, but they're going to pull up anyway. Phase over the hill line. Rob's in danger. Tries to get cover. He finds it, but AC gets the kill. Uber, though, goes down. Where's the trades? Coming back through. Puna Chow down. That's going to be from Otho bailing in towards this one. AC just hip firing away with the SLR, hoping for the best. Shinboy quickly oh. comes around and Phase go out in 15. Left him down to one, and now Tiamba. Actually, oh, look at this. Oath. Oath. They're reading this. They saw this. They're going to crash on top of it as well. Oh god, this is dangerous. Yeah, maybe you know, cut the losses and just move it out, but A trade, this is a dangerous run. Burram are right there. You're gonna get sprayed down. Their aim is so sharp for Burram. But yeah, you might escape one, but you're going right towards Oath. Oath are gonna just e farm this. Yeah. Two dead, three dead. Bye bye. It. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, Wookie. Oh, no. Uh, Wookie just collided with a ridge. The vehicle. This is an interesting choice. They do have the smoke trail to oh, try God. and get through this. Oh, no. Oh, they hit the trolley. Oh, they're going to get farmed. Oh, we've got hot drops DA everywhere. Jumping on oh. 4 a.m. There is action going on all over the place. And punches are being thrown. Uzi's and Vectors are in play. I can even give track of who's live and who isn't. Godby and Lou are on their own trying to fight off DA. This is a complete and utter chaos situation. And DA has fallen. Something I think I can say confidently. Uh, oh, no. Is DA and 4AM oh, doing Oh, my this God. Again? They're doing it. Welcome to the They're madness, ladies again. and gents. It's mayhem. We got punches. We got pistols. We've got early fights going down. Oh, Code Marcos fell one. This is a disaster for both teams, but it's absolutely what I love about this at 4 a.m. <laughs> Just kick DA in the teeth. Goodbye. The stupidest thing about this is Sonics has probably the worst situation out of everybody, but the fact that they've got these four the vehicles, tires. the fact that they've held Ow. them... They all have tires. Nobody shot anything out yet. They can pretty much play from wherever they want and where they decide to play is the tractor. They set up their vehicle for it. Buriram now has to leave. And this is such good positioning here from Sonics. But trying to go for it. He's in the vehicle. Oh, good name, good name. No, he's wrapping around really the other good way. Name. Oh, that's a good name from Kickstart. Ooh, oh, Kickstart, dangerous game. Right Okay, okay, we've got two standing pretty much the against two. Kickstart's vest is broken. Everything is screwed for him. He is the gun by his side. Chinboy has to almost be the tank of this, and he ain't looking so tanky. AT is still sitting pretty, and keep in mind, Gustav is threed up. So if Zenith do this, it is against the odds. However, Gustav finds Kickstart, and now Shinboy left in the 1v2. He's isolated one. He's got the tag, not the frag, though. Spins around, looks for more. His cover's now oh, gone yes. in the open. He's got to face the music and phase. I cannot believe it. They survived the week in some style. That is unbelievable. The final game of the the entire run of the week. And they make it happen. It was the one going to try and open up for Gen G. Look at it, infantry are so close to the blue. There's, there's no way they can get through this. The blue's going to force them forward. They are the dead nades. in the water. One nade comes out. It's... Oh, no! my God! Oh, for him! My word. Seriously? Eventually, half the compound is out of the next circle, and it's undivined to make push forward.
it's kind of wild how open and exposed those hangars can be even if you think you're inside a compound like mm. just the, the front of it in itself is just so open oh my god <laughs> a nade from the gods finds its target and and now i did not know besto was this close up and over pin is pulled Ooh. does it find its target <laughs> absolutely does and now comes the push from besto this man is feeling it today Christ. rock and roll and away we go is this the team that we know toby they seem to have come alive today it sure as hell looks like they've claimed the west side of the circle and they've been withstanding everything coming their way so far i think i've seen four or five knocked players on navi and they're still all full up that's how we know navi can play that's how dominant they can be and i oh am my not God. wait did he just trip <gasps> did he just take out the entirety of k7 liquid and infantry fight will commence even with a knock i'm not sure any follow-ups will come in what does I say that? <laughs> Jeez. Uh, yep, that's a bit of the skull. Just uh, torn apart. Long scope. I think it's really just, it's up to NBK Amidi. I mean, they can ruin this completely for game. I mean, look at this. CC has no idea that his life is not even in his own hands. Oh. Oh! oh what? <laughs> you can't. One strong squad and two solos hiding out in the same building. Nexi's still alive for TL here. He's got, uh, well, you got you got the European building. as Mexi and, <laughs> and Diggory just holding down two different angles here, just trying to survive. To be able to get the heal over time on, finds the angle onto Fuzz Face. You'll see the mollies come in, and the floor is absolute lava right now. He's burning behind the box, and this is the time for them to move. VP in the kill feed. A knock onto Ike's left, but one will return back on the side of it. Ike's left will be actually taken down as well, but so is Mile. Bale Frost now onto Uber. Fuzz face in a one-on-one -on -one scenario with the box has to rub it round, but you'll see both of them. The flashbangs come through. He is just firing blind into the metal. They have no idea where they are because of the flashbangs coming out. Thankfully, Snickers goes down on the side. Nicely and coming out of 80. One, two, thank you. Time to mop up. But all of a sudden, it's a one versus one. How has it come to be? How are we in this position? Flashbang goes over the vehicle. Who will be winning this one out? Pat Caps comes back for a vengeance. His hands are in the air. He just doesn't care. He's no idea where it is. Fighting round the box. Oh! It's Pat Caps wins it out. Face clan goes down. 13th position. If he does, oh, he does now with the first initial shots gone down, but win, win with two of them. There's one more Luke 12 in the open. He's been the savior that SQ needed to be able to put a stop gap on this. SQ yesterday, they started this event with a win. And that is how we end day number two. You can see it.